If you want to measure PPFD and you're a home grower, chances are you don't want to spend a lot of money in something like this. If that's the case, consider getting something like this, the UNI-T Lux Meter. So the UNI-T Lux Meter will measure in Lux, but what's good about it is, you can convert this in an app called the PPFD Meter app, which I'll show you now, and it is very accurate. We'll now grab the Uni T Lux meter. So, turn it on. I've preloaded the PPFD meter app. So, go into sensor. You make sure that the Uni T Lux meter is selected. Go back. Go into PPFD and DLI. You hold in the on button for a couple of seconds. It will then pair it to Bluetooth. And you'll see it is now showing up what the PPFD is on the Uni T Lux meter. So we're holding that in the exact same position and it's showing up at about 460 PPFD roughly. Well, 462 now. And if we remember, the Apogee in the same position Is showing up at 483 so about 20 ppfd difference for less than 50 dollars one thing to point out though make sure whenever you're in this menu you go into the options and you select what your spectrum is so our micro lights are three and a half thousand kelvin and these lights are on for 12 hours a day so i've set that and that'll work out my daily light integral or my dli and you can also create your own power map. If you don't want to buy any equipment, you can just use the PPFD meter app on your phone using the front facing camera. So all you'll need is a piece of paper to put over the front as a wee diffuser. Uh, I've just tested that on my phone. Uh, one of the other guys in the office just tested it on his phone. It still works, it's still fairly accurate. Uh, but there was a bit of variation between both of our phones, even though they were both iPhones, just different models. Um, so personally, I think for the small cost of what the Uni T is, it's definitely worthwhile buying. But if you find this useful, please give it a like and a share, and we'll catch up with you guys soon.